In times of overcapacity and print runs of smaller sizes, staple production runs, a high degree of machine availability and a reduction in setup times become increasingly important. One of the causes of time-consuming cleaning processes is ground rough roller surfaces such as those found in the basic configuration of many offset printing units. Various pigments are deposited in the surface structures of these rollers that can only be removed with considerable effort. The solution. Lototech MRS, the modular roller system with the patented Lototech coating. The normal linking roller material, 25 Shore A, is a very soft white mesh material. This structure allows the material to adapt pigments, salts and calcium complexes, which results in hydrophilization. This hydrophilization creates more water in the ink, causing the print to destabilize. Lototech is a patented coating system. The coating is based on fluoridated rubber, which we apply in the aqueous phase. Fluoridated rubber is a close relative of Teflon. Due to the extremely low surface tension, the material does not adapt pigments or ink. It repels them. Customers have very little startup waste. They can reach the desired color tone immediately and have the advantage of being able to go from a dark color to a light color with one wash, thereby saving a tremendous amount of time and cleaning agent. The rollers with the patented Lototech coating are available for inking and dampening units and can simply optimize an OEM basic configuration. In the first module, the standard inking rollers are replaced by Verograph LT inking rollers. In the MRS Module 2, the non-driven Rilsan rollers are also replaced with Lototech ETC distributor roller elements. The influence of the different configurations on the cleaning process is shown in the following sequence. It is impressive to see how the low surface tension of the special rollers affects the quality and speed of the cleaning process. When changing to a very light color, it is very easy to see in the subsequent print test whether there is any residual ink in the previously cleaned print unit. The deviation of the ink trapping strip from the reference color is measured using the spectral densitometer and compared to the normal technical deviation. The result is impressive. No, this result is impressive. Following the first washing process, a print unit equipped in this way reaches the right color tone after just a few sheets. The usual rewashing is not necessary.